My name is Ted Patrick. I'm a technical evangelist with Adobe, and today I want to show you some of our work on bringing Air to Android devices. We have some very rich tooling in, in Flash and Air, uh, in Flash Builder and Flash Professional. Today I'm going to take Flash Professional and build a project and export it to uh, an Android smartphone and run it in Air. So here I am in Flash Pro. And if I run this application, it's pretty straightforward. It produces a, a visualization using the hype framework. And if I actually click on different locations, this kind of swarm behavior occurs. Now, to get this application, to get this Swift uh, running on the phone, I actually have to package it with uh, the Android SDK. Now, to do that, it requires uh, a little bit of command line work. But moving forward, our tooling is going to make that process much, much simpler, just as it is for Air on the desktop today. So to do that, I'm going to use TextMate, and I'm going to run this command line. And the Air SDK is going to build the application. It's then going to call the Android SDK and actually uh, push the application to the device. And if I log into the device here, I can go to the menu, and you can see the application that I compiled is right here. And there we have the same running application that was running on my desktop, running on a phone. It is actually that easy from a packaging and export functionality. And that's a really big deal because anyone who can build Flash content can now build first class applications uh, for a growing number of devices in the market. So let's take a look at what some of the other developers on our pre-release have been doing with this SDK. So here's a game called Crossfire. It was written by Josh Tingela. Uh, if I select a piece and move it there, it actually is a nice block game. Let's hop over. Uh, this is a running app uh, that uses uh, GPS data and devices or uh, sensors on the phone. And uh, what you'll see is it actually tracks my data uh, as I'm going on uh, using Google Maps. And it actually calculates how many miles I've actually run. So here we are. We're going to load Adobe Directory. This is an internal enterprise application that allows us to find uh, anyone within the company. So I'm going to type in my name. Uh, and it's going to run a search. And I'm going to pick myself from the list, hit Enter. It's actually going to open up our enterprise backend and actually show me all my information. And you can show where you are in the building by clicking on the maps. And also, you can click on the calendar to see uh, what the individual schedule is. And that's it. There's a great opportunity for designers and developers to bring their creative work uh, to these new class of devices and to use the development tools that you already know and love. If you want to learn more, sign up for the pre-release at Adobe Labs.